We are um, an HR department within DHL and we are employee feedback. So we are responsible for all topics covering employee feedback studies. As we are a company with more than 500,000 employees, it's a big thing for us that um, we want to make sure that every voice counts and every voice is heard. So um, yeah, that's what basically what we are there for. The main challenges that we are facing at DHL is that we are a very big corporation. So whenever we launch surveys or feedback initiatives, we usually get data on a very large scale, which faces us with the issue that we uh, need some sort of automation processes behind analyzing the comments, because simply reading through the comments is at a certain level simply not possible anymore. So. The biggest challenge is basically the data size that we have and then also the time pressure or the timelines that we work towards because of course we're usually also expected to deliver results at a fast pace. So I think those are the two things that basically um, ask for um, an automated solution. We solved the issue of the timelines and also the automation by using Yuka Plena um, as a, a software provider so that we can now um, analyze, translate and also anonymize the comments that we receive because one big um, priority for us is also ensuring anonymity of our employees. So we really want to make sure that all the feedback that we capture stays anonymous and we protect our employees. Um, but it is also very important to generate insights also for management that they can follow up on, right? So I think one of the biggest rules when it comes to employee feedback is if you ask for feedback, you also need to do something. And um, the great thing with uh, Kaplina is, is that we can now get topics and, and sentiments attached to it that enable us to provide managers with insights, but also enable a follow-up after collecting this data, right? So we can identify problem areas, but also things that are working well. And we also have the possibility to show them improvement areas and link them also to quantitative data, right? Because especially for middle and top management, we usually have the feedback that they need some sort of business relevancy for the projects that we are doing. And we can now also link the rating scores that the employees have given with the text feedback that they have given so that we can make also the insights that we generate more, um, let's say, easily digestible for managers. First big benefit uh, that we get is that we have a very time efficient solution. So we can streamline all of our reporting processes from translation to anonymization, topic modeling, as well as sentiment analysis within one tool. The second improvement would be that um, we have the possibility to enable open comment feedback in a now broader scale as we did before due to the streamlining of all of those processes. The third biggest improvement, so to speak, is that we can um, basically offer all of those things also as a cost efficient um, solution, because if it's a manual process, it not only takes more time, but it usually is also more cost um, ineffective, so to speak. So to summarize, the third biggest benefit is definitely cost efficiency. Also for future implication when it comes to analyzing open comments, we are now looking into the possibility of implementing touch point monitoring. So we are looking at, for example, the possibility to look at how is onboarding perceived, how is um, recruiting perceived. So also there we um, have now the challenge that this is very fast feedback because we need to of course survey employees quite directly after those touch points have happened so um, also there an automated solution is very very helpful to directly capture and analyze feedback after those touch points have happened